practice of examine has been the thing that has transformed me as an individual from someone who came to the Lord and thought he was next to perfect, <laughs> flawless, to uh, really having uh, to confront who I am in reality and, uh, and see all the things that were just a wreck and a mess. I look at my coming to the Lord like he took me by the hand and said, you're coming home with me. We got a little cleanup to do on the way. And it took, I want to say a decade for me to see the, the depths of my sin and need for him. So uh, it really, in some ways culminated with a divorce. That's when examine really got deep uh, when my former wife uh, asked for a divorce. And that, um, that was an incredible work of God. That was uh, counseling, that was uh, uh, examination on steroids for me. The scripture became so central and such a guide and such a help. I learned about the attributes of God and his, his power and his nature and his care and his sacrificial love. And that, that impacted me and have helped me come through the enormous adjustments that had to be made in, in, in me through, through loss. When I approach examine, there's, there's a number of things that I do. Um, I listen to the scripture in the morning when, uh, when I'm making my coffee and my lunch, get ready to get out the door. Uh, I read uh, from a, a Bible app and study a little bit deeper from the commentaries that are available. And uh, I'll listen to uh, the preaching and try and focus on the message. Uh, some of the challenges I have is I'm, I'm you know, easily distracted. So I'm just trying like, hey, let's come back here or don't lose that thought while you're commuting to work. You know, save that phone call for later and uh, get this deeper thought and prayer done. So those are those are some of the things that I do to help me examine. Through his word, I think in the practice of examine, I'm realizing my purposes in being here in knowing the Lord in being transformed by him in accomplishing his purposes and personally in having myself changed in a way that I love others like I never did before. I really did not know what, what love was when I came to know the Lord and have had to go through, through a, a number of harsh experiences to really get to the, begin to get to the bottom of me. And that, that's part of what the Lord does through his spirit-driven words on that printed page.